and Zilla would show why they're one of the best teams in the state as they came out to a big lead at halftime 44-30 and would go on for the 84-56 win. Coach Levi Hyan says it was a learning experience for his young squad. The difference between Zilla and us, uh, I, I think that we're both pretty solid offensively. We can both score a lot of points. Um, the difference is they, they play the same intensity on the defensive end as they do on the offensive end, and we're not quite there yet. Hines says that Zilla is one of the top teams in the state, and that's where Cashmere eventually wants to be. They're actually, you know, they're, they're the team that we look to as like, do we want to be like this team? This team is senior loaded. Uh, our team is mostly so sophomore dominated. Um, we knew it was going to be a tough challenge. I didn't think it would turn out this way, to be quite honest with you. Um, but I, I give 100% credit to Zilla and their defense. They put pressure on us. They, they didn't give us any room to breathe. And, you know, the guy guarding the ball was all over us. And then when we went to turn to pass to somebody, that guy was covered up. And uh, we haven't seen that kind of pressure. And we watch it on film, but to go out there and experience is something different. So uh, they just took it to us defensively, um, really put pressure on us, and, and, and struggled to uh, to get, to allow us to get going offensively. So it's an early entrance into the state 1A tournament for Cashmere as they'll play at 345 on Wednesday against Kingsway Christian. Coach Hyan says that he hopes his club learns from the lessons in the Zilla game. Um, moving forward, you know, like I said, that they set the bar for where we want to be. That's what a state championship team looks like. Um, we're not quite there yet, but you know, we're still in the hunt. And we, the state tournament starts again on Wednesday, this kind of for seed, and, and that's our mentality is our goals are still set to the top. You know, we still have a chance to be number one. That's going to be our goal. And until that's an op, not an option, then we move to the next goal. So, um, yeah, we're just going to keep pressing forward on Wednesday and see what happens.